Oh yeah, this is where I left off. <sighs> You're right. Anything I do for yeah. you? Yeah. Uh, well, this is. No, not really. I'm just gonna mood. So. <laughs> You know how it is. Highs and lows, man. Highs and lows. Yep. Life is like a wave. And I am a chinchilla. Be careful. If you didn't know, chinchillas are allergic to water. Probably shouldn't be in the ocean or the waves. Oh, <laughs> uh, fuck. What movies are there? there what the fuck did I want to try to find? I gotta find... Uh, I gotta find where I can watch... What the hell is that TV show called? Um... Just like Not that, something okay. you would watch, but I, I don't you. even want to watch it, you wouldn't know. God damn it. Sure is nice to go up what the fuck change. was that show called? The pillar's not much further. <laughs> Yeah, this one right here. Yellowstone. Good to go. This time, not all the time. It's not. I don't think it's your kind of fucking show. It's about ranch out fucking west. Okay. Not they do some cowboy shit. <laughs> I don't mean like they do like cowboy shit, like yeehaw cowboy shit, but they do some like cowboy justice. You understand what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Certain people fuck with the wrong people and go away. I just watched an anime called hey, Shonen Sample. Go ahead and secure the exit. Yeah. <laughs> it's about. Never heard of it. It's about a guy that gets kidnapped from his school to be transferred to another school that's all about all female school, 
or oh god they're um they're trained to be like the prim and proper to so they can be married off by wealthy people families mm-hmm. and they bring him in because they need a commoner because in the past their girls would go into the real world and they would they weren't ready for it so they figured mm-hmm. bringing a man a, a common person to yeah kind of show them shown in sample okay it's fucking funny because this sounds like the uh, i read one called girls of the wild that was kind of like that and, it, and so he gets there and they're like well he's like well, why'd you choose me i'm nobody special because he's not he's not like high and that's end. why we chose you and they're like well because you know you're kind you're all this and then they're like and also you like um the biggest and best quality of you that we cannot find in any other category like you is that you like oily muscly men and he's like what? oh no what he's he and she's like yes because of that we let you choose we let you stay here because we know that you are not gonna you're learn. gay they think he's gay <laughs> yes and he's like but i'm not he's, the girl's like oh if that's the case we either have to send you to like a bar place or cut your balls off and he's like, I oh God. love muscles. I love oily, muscly man. Yes. Yeah. Oh my God. That's fucking hilarious. <laughs> and so then he just lives on this school, going to school as the only guy. And all these girls like fawn over him because they're like, he's a commoner. He's like a rare species. And like, he's he a guy. Makes, yeah. And he makes friends with these four different girls. Of course. Um, one girl. It's not a harem. 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 He 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 gets uh a popular girl, big boob popular girl. He friends a weird, you know, small chest, tiny little girl. Of course. Friends a swordsman that of course tries to be super quiet, super strong. Yeah. And the one that super loud and super strong. There's one of the four girls that I wasn't. A fawn of, um, they she's portrayed. She's a smart girl. She has her own facility, and she basically is like a a complete genius. So, and then you you get introduced to her, and he's like, the way you get introduced to her is that she's he's out on a fucking uh, park bench, and you see her. He sees her, and she her body structure is like a fucking eight year old. So she looks like a tiny little child. Oh, okay. So it's one of them. Yeah. Is she though, or is it just one of those but ones that they, they portray it as, and she's like really like thirty five? So she's the and same she age like she's as nine. them. She's same age as them, but looks like a nine year old. But there's. Let me guess. Hold on. She's super smart, like a genius, and she's got the fucking the tech lab, like you said, and she's got and she's pissed that she's got tiny tits. No, nope, she says she actually very little talking to anything. The issue, the problem with it is anytime she has like her mind flare where she can, her genius action and where she, she literally yeah. writes down anything that comes to her mind on the wall or anywhere she can as soon as she thinks it. But okay. when she's doing it, she gets completely undressed. Oh. And the reason why oh. I have a problem with it is because she has a body of a, like an eight, nine year old. Okay. Yeah, I can she see what She looks like an eight, nine year old. And I was like, this that's that that's not no, no, that's not that's not funny. That's not cute. That's 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 disturbing. I I, I, ha, 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 ha. I better turn this off before I get a red dot above my house. <laughs> like you don't see anything, obviously, but it is like every time it's she implied. Dies. Oh yeah. And he's he puts clothes on her every time. He's like, No, 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 no. And when he first meets her, he thought she was a child. And he was like, no, no, you need to get dressed. And, like, the first time he saw her, she was, like, butt-ass naked in the middle of a fucking cart yard writing her ideas on a fucking, like, statue. And he's like, this little girl's defacing the school. I can't let that happen. And now she's and naked. She's what the fuck? Naked. So he... he she's fucking naked. So he picks up 
the clothes and starts picking them, uh, starting to get her dressed so she's not inappropriate. And he sees girls coming. He's like, I can't let people see this. Right? <laughs> I don't want I'm gone. So he picks up the girl and fucking runs to his room. Oh, no. No. <laughs> no. So fucked up. And so later on, the gr- one, the girl, the quiet, the, not the quiet one, the, the weird one, small yeah. structure, she meets, sees her, and everything, he's like, don't let her get too close. And he's like, what do you mean? She may look like she's a little, little girl, but she's the same age as us. I know what she wants. And she's, like, sitting in his lap. Oh. Oh, my. So, that was the only part of the anime I was like, nah, not a, not a fan of this. I'm not into this. This is not Yeah, cool. no, no, no. Not, this is not cool. Like, I don't get no, why they, no, no. animes sometimes do that. Like, make a little, a girl be seen like a little child. Hey, Corey, 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 why does anime have giant tentacle monsters fucking high school girls? Like, but it's one thing, like, the culture is okay with, like, I guess, 16 The, yeah, the culture, yeah, because the culture is okay with it. That's why they do that shit. Like, that's just they, they don't have like, it. I they don't, don't have an mm. issue with it against fucking, if you draw a little kid... It's just gross. Getting all that stuff over there, you're not gonna fucking get in trouble, and they've already we've established that. If you do it here, you're gonna go to jail, and then you ain't gonna last because they're gonna call you a fucking. You're gonna get a label, and it's gonna be plastered across your forehead as your guts are plastered all over the fucking courtyard in the next couple of days. I just, I, I was that was the only part of the anime I didn't like. Other than that, it was, it was funny. I get it. I don't. One of the scenes when he you get first introduced to the swordsman girl, she's like has her own style of swordsman and starts uh-huh. fighting him. And while she's doing it, all the girls around are around and she cuts off their clothes, so they're all the all they are is in bras and panties. Right. And, they, and this swordsman girl's like, What did you do to them? He's like, I didn't fucking do it, you did it. And then one point in the thing, he finally says, I can't do this. I can't keep running away. So he runs after her. And he fucking tackles her down while she's doing her thing. And he's, like, finally there. And he lifts up. And her head, he's, like, trying to stand up. And her head, like, not far from his crotch. And his fucking boxers and everything got cut off. Because somehow. Of course. And all, it just shows a shining light in her face. And she's like, oh! And she fucking passes out. I'm like, oh my god, this is hilarious. Just fucking <laughs> no. Oh, the, I was watching it one morning. My wife had to uh, get Zion in the morning. She was going somewhere. And <laughs> she's sitting there on the couch with him. And she looks up at it. And there's a scene where the the big, busty, popular girl and the weird girl uh, are kind of course. like wrestling each other mad at each other because they they all end up falling in love with the main character obviously yeah the harem and <laughs> the two girls are in bras and panties fighting each other and he's like this would not be a problem i'm not having a problem with this and my wife looks up and she goes what the fuck are you watching <laughs> i'm like laughing and like it's a it's a comedy she's like yeah yeah, yeah. uh-huh she looks over and zion's looking up at the screen she's like it's his first porno and i'm like it doesn't show anything mm. <laughs> just fucking wow <laughs> see i don't even i don't watch those kind anything that's kind of got anything that can do with that i don't really care for i don't mind it as long as it's this one was it was it was on a funny part. Other than the, the, the See, smart believe girl. believe it or not, I do mm-hmm. tend to watch anime for the action and the story, not the fan service. No, I I I have to find these animes have a decent like I don't know. It depends on it on how it is portrayed and how it's done. Mm-hmm. I don't want something that's really weird. Like I don't know how to say it. It's some of them are really fucked up. And I don't, is I don't, this fucking legal? Like, I can't watch some like that, but I don't know. I get it. I know I've been I'm, into more of a story-driven or character development than action. I haven't really been in the mood for action anime at all, so I haven't been watching them. Looks like they're hungry for more. 
We're not delicious. Not even a little bit. Get going. Now. Okay. You too. But there's too many of them. Not for me. Back off or die. Look how I'm using a bat and it's doing the slicing. Like I'm cutting them down. No, we should like be hit somebody. Yeah! <laughs> uh, it's like when you hit somebody with your elbow. You can cut them with your elbow. Yeah, but it doesn't sound like I'm slicing them. Like a knife. Well, no. I think if you hit somebody with a sword, it wouldn't Understood. make a, it wouldn't make a the avalanche mission's been proved. noise like you assume any of their... True. It's going to be more Missing like the bat, I think. What the hell are they thinking? <laughs> Actually. <laughs> I'm not sure what it makes. I've never cut anything done. like that. I've Some cut things, but it didn't make a noise. Definitely not like, swing! Then it happened. It's usually like, oh, fuck, I cut myself. Guess it's a little late to grow oh, shit. Like when I cut my knee with the chainsaw? Yeah, no. That was. There was no huh? swing with that one. Was, ah! No, I didn't make a fucking noise. I was mad. Don't I was worry. cutting. We'll uh, it was when we time. had goats and I was cutting trees to put fucking. She had her friend here and. Her friend was being great. Um, and then she asked me to go out when it was a billion fucking degrees and put fence in the, the, for the goats. And I'm like, all right, whatever. So I was in shorts and I was out there cutting down little trees. And the chainsaw rode up one of the fucking trees and got me right underneath where I was wearing shorts. And it didn't really, it wasn't like, Nyah! like into my fucking leg. It was like it ran up the tree and the blade was in the process of stopping when it fucking slapped my leg. And it literally almost went deep enough to be very bad. But it was not deep enough to where I didn't have to go to the hospital or anything. But I literally was... You've never been to my house to where you know where it is. Um, I have an idea about your house. Yeah, but I don't know. Yeah, no, no, no. Like 500 feet maybe is where I was away from the fucking house. And I literally one foot hopped. Holding my fucking knee together because I knew... I looked... And I saw fucking chunks missing, and I saw white. There was no blood yet. And before I fucking did anything, before I fucking passed out, I just literally held it as tight as I could, and one leg hopped inside. Because I was like, this is going to fucking bleed everywhere. So by the time I got into the fucking house, that just started to bleed. And yeah, Kim was like, um, what the fuck did you do? Uh, and then well, you know. she had to fix it. Yeah, I was like, yeah, fix it. Lost in here. This is the same graveyard, and then right? she fixed it, and then I went out and Treasure still fixed the fence, great. and then... I was sore the next couple days. Just past that large maintenance facility over there. I vote we stay big chunks. Right, so I have fucking scars on the bottom of my knee now. I have everywhere. two big like rectangles missing from where the teeth hit me. And there's like a space in between where you can see where the chain, like it is the. I don't know if you've ever fucked with a chainsaw, but it goes oh, yeah. uh, tooth and then a break and then a tooth. Yep. Yeah, well, you can see it's where the deserted. fucking break was. And kind of creepy. People don't come around here often. And not just because of the monsters, but because of the stories. What kind? Everyone seems to think that the train graveyard is haunted. Those who lose their way out there in the dark of night will never, ever find their way back home again. <gasps> is that right? I mean, it's not like I think it's true or anything. But, you know, it's just... Then let's hurry.
Mithro Rod. Ooh. We got a new weapon. Yep. Ooh. Okay. What's it do? Ray of Judgment. Fires an energy burst that hits multiple enemies, increasing stagger bonus. Well, basically, shoots a laser. Nice. All right. EA Sports. It's in the game. Wow. Fucking hundred percent. Fucking magic staff. Constantly builds up magic. Hundred and eight on magic? Damn. That's powerful. Mr. Sadman. Really, Dick? Yes. Oh, I don't want rented movies. Weekly special, there we go. Neither did I. Didn't the planet, the kingdom of the planet of the apes, just come out in theaters, I or think just get so. out of theaters? Well, it's available for free on fucking uh, Hulu already. Fight Club. We don't talk about Fight Club. Have you seen the Suicide Squad anime? No, but I've seen clips of it, and it looks dope it's as not, fuck. It's not fucking bad. It's... So, I don't know. I kind of fucking stopped paying attention because I got distracted doing something. But I know... It's... It's definitely... Worth a try. I've seen some bits and pieces of it, and it looks dope. It's not bad. But, like, they get different fucking powers. Like, they, it's sort of like, you know how, like, normally they have whatever fucking, like, Harlequin really doesn't have powers. 
apparently she gets like fucking strength or some shit. Interesting. I don't know. I don't know. It's it's weird. I, again, I have to fucking. It, it, that's just my interpretation. Because one of the dudes has uh, clay powers where he can just fucking usually turn his body into clay and that's all he can manipulate is his own fucking body. Well, and he even said, he's like, now that we're here, because you know the basis of it, like why they're in like an anime or whatever? No, I didn't even see that. So it, it's called Suicide Squad. Basically, I think it's called fucking Suicide Squad Iseki. Which is basically, Iseki means to travel to another world. Yeah, Suicide Squad Iseki. And it's, what it is, is it's, to me, Iseki means to travel to another world. So if you see any kind of anime that says Iseki in it, that means they're going to travel, they're from a fucking one world, and they're going to go to another one. Probably a fantasy type world with dragons and magic versus one that we have here. Okay? And so what it happens is, you know, have you seen the movie Suicide Squad? Uh, yeah, uh, yes, the first one at least, not the second one. Yeah, 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 that's fine, that's fine, that's who you need. Well, see, that's then you won't understand some of the characters in it, like, um, the shark, uh, and the, um, peacemaker. You won't know who they're from the fucking second one. The clay man, I don't know where the fuck he's from. He's not from anyone. They're the, the pyro guy was honestly my fucking favorite. Me but too. yeah, the, the, Clay guy's not there. Um, but yeah, so why that black girl's there? The fucking Waller or whatever, and Flag is in it too. Rick Flag, they're both in it. But what happens is they're on Earth and they end up finding a fucking portal and they open it up or some shit and they end up going to a different magical fucking land, like with that the dudes right. It's like a fucking elf and they don't understand the language, right? And they got a fucking, they can do magic and they get, they can fly and all that stuff, but they don't have guns. You know what I mean? And, uh, Deadshot, which is the Will Smith character, he's in it. And fucking Peacemaker is basically Deadshot, I want to say, but he's just, he says everything he does is for peace and he will literally murder a whole village full of kittens and fucking children if he's told it's for the betterment of mankind and it's for the pursuit of peace, he will go and fucking do it with his teeth. He's fucking psycho. But yeah, uh, anyways, so in, I think, the first episode, they fucking... Do you, can I tell you about it, or is it going to ruin it for you? I mean, give me snobs of it, basics. Okay, so... As I said, they get different powers, and what I think is going to happen, like, that's... I don't know when they go to different places i think because there's more than one world i think they're gonna get stronger and stronger or just accumulate different powers i don't fucking know because in the clay man like i said he can only control the clay that's within his body well he's able to control the clay in the ground now and it even said he even said it in the fucking anime he's like oh i think my powers have increased and i think harley ends up getting I'm, I'm assuming she does because you see when, when he says that she gets that you know that like when people fucking oh hey bing, and it kind of like shows a screen light up and it's like hey alert to this character we're remembering a certain situation that's kind of what happened um, with Harley I don't know if she actually has a power but no, I'm gonna she actually doesn't. watch she's it. human I see I know she doesn't have a power I know that but I'm uh, thinking in this I show see. she might have a power I understand just like fucking Deadshot doesn't have a power. He's just a fucking human, but he just doesn't miss his shot. Beastmaker doesn't fucking he doesn't have a superpower either. Clayman has a power, fucking King the the Shark Man, I can't remember his name. His King, King is it King? I can't remember. Anyways, he fucking he, it's a Shark Man and he's like he's got fucking regular legs, regular arms. But he's got the top half of a shark, yeah. And he's—I uh, think he's a god, or he was a god, or something like that. And he's basically indestructible. He, like he gets shot and it heals instantly. And he can fucking eat anything, and he's always hungry. <laughs> Actually, in Suicide Squad 2, he tries to eat one of his fucking friends or like the people he's working with, 
while they're fucking sleeping because he's he's like half asleep and he just picks him up and he starts to fucking put him in his mouth. It's hilarious. But what pisses me off in the movie, in the movie, is he barely talks. In the fucking anime, he talks way more than he does in the movie. And I'm not sure where the timeline falls in this movie, if it's between the two Suicide Squads, or what. Because, I don't know, Harley knows the fucking, the shark from the second one. And those Peacemaker in the second one. But Peacemaker dot, I think. Well, no, 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 no. Nobody does. Somebody does. I don't fucking know. Nothing to it. Give you all kinds of spoilers. Not in the anime, though. Trying to hold See, I didn't second. watch the second one because... Don't waste your time. I didn't... I didn't like the fact that Will Smith was no longer... He's not. Deadshot's no longer in it. Deadshot in two is. No, he's not. That's not Deadshot. Who is it then? The the black guy is. It's it's a different fucking. I don't know what his name is, but it's not fucking Deadshot. Because I said the same goddamn thing. Guys, I was like, this is horseshit. I'm not watching it because they they changed the fucking actor, and I thought they changed Deadshot's character. <laughs> But they didn't. I don't think his name is. I don't think that is actually headshot. I can, I'll look right now. But I'm, I'm pretty sure. But it is a. It is a black guy, and it, he basically does have almost the same a power at, or the same ability set as that shot. His name is Bloodsport. You guys and it's, too? it's played by oh, Idris Elba. Out here this late. What? Then... King Shark. <laughs> I know about him. Yeah, he's played by Sylvester Stallone. But yeah, he's fucking, um... Yeah. Bloodsport is the character he plays. Not fucking Deadshot. But yeah, I understand what you mean. I was, I was very upset with it too. But did you ever watch Birds of Prey or Bird of Prey with the Harley Quinn spinoff or whatever the fuck it was? No. If you can fuck it. So, you know how, like, the first Suicide Squad was kind of, it wasn't the best movie, but it was still all right. Right. Like, I would have paid to see it in the theaters, but I would not have been... Yay! Like I'm not gonna be the first one there at a midnight showing for it, but Focus. I would have paid for like a Saturday night at night. Deal with that. I'm if I would have paid for fucking Bird of Prey or Suicide Squad 2, I would not have been happy with my money. One more shot. I, didn't spend for that. I don't think that was a, a theater-worthy movie. They're not bad movies. It's just not. not I don't think so. I mean, I guess any movie in the theater is really good to see, but you understand what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. Wrong way. You're gonna get one gill. What the fuck? I'm getting trolled by a kid. In what? In Final Fantasy. There's like a dead, I guess a ghost kid. 
Oh, at least they're portraying in the game. It's a ghost kid. I don't recall this in the original, so this is new. Keep it together. I'll show you what I can do. She is super fucking. Earth is super fucking strong. Laser is fucking powerful. Ooh, materia. What are you gonna me? What are you gonna give me? Orb of HP up. Nice. Cha 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 ra cha 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 What day was the Diablo new season come out? You said the seventh or second? No. Today is the second. Six. I would not be fucking just chilling. Me neither. I'm probably the homes. I'm not. Would not be chilling at the home fucking screen. Just shitting. No. Huh? What is that? I would be almost level 100 by now. Because <laughs> that shit starts at fucking like what one o'clock or two o'clock. Yeah. One in the afternoon and okay? it's fucking what is it two? What? Uh, all good. I one, think. Two o'clock at night. Still in no. Fuck no. It's not even midnight yet. So yeah, it's uh two to midnight. Guys? So it's ten hours. Fuck yeah. I. I've only ever played six hours straight when the new season came out. I'm pretty sure Seriously? that I could get to level 100 in 10 hours. Come on, huh? That's you know that's what well, that's uh, Chris and I are gonna do, inviting. right? The what? first when the new season comes out, we're gonna have a fucking from the time we pick up, uh, we're gonna start a character and we ain't fucking stopping that character until it's level 100. Simple though. Like. You no, know, like we ain't putting the fucking remote down until we're level 100. All right, let's see what's inside. It's also very simple. <laughs> well, fuck I'm you. not. I'm not saying it, it's not. All I'm saying is it's very doable. Yeah, well, it'll take like 10 fucking hours. Well, it's gonna take you all day well, to do it, but you what can do, do you it. think? Yeah, and then mm. I'm gonna be like, nah, what a waste of time. I'm game. Huh? Uh, but it'll Never be do fine. it again. We've got a bodyguard, don't forget. Hopefully it's a rainy day. Fine. I don't feel bad. Um, right? Ghosts aren't my thing. Can I get the forecast, please? <sighs> You're just being modest. After you. You mind letting me go then? <laughs> mm. Dude, you got two beautiful women crawling on your arms like that. I would die to have Tifa holding my arms like that. What was that? Look, over there. Found you. Hey, can we talk just for a bit? Take the lead. 
care of you. That ray is so what, what ray are you talking about? She I, this new ability I just obtained so powerful. I know, but even so. I don't understand beard hair sometimes. Thanks, Cloud. You saved us. I'll fucking brush it all, and then all of a sudden I'll have one that's just sticking fucking straight out in left field. I fucking pull that right the fuck out. I don't. I, you know what I do? I twist it, and it fucking goes back to where it's supposed to. Find another way through. No, I get sick of them. Yeah, come on. Yeah, well, see, there's a difference between me and you, sir. You've been able to grow a beard since you were like seven. Like not seventh grade, but like seven years old. <laughs> you always run away, right? You came out of the I'll show you what I can do. Sir. I've been what growing my facial saw? hair for a year, and you have more than I do in an hour. Gotta go for it now. <laughs> yeah, this is definitely not in the original. I do not recall this stuff. Corey, what you have for breakfast? Um, beef, rice, and veggies. Fuck did you go? The Chinese food place? I guess the mm. crane's up there. No, um, my, uh... I said... I, okay, I was... Okay, one, I was being smart-ass, because I was going to be like, do you even remember what you have a breakfast? Oh, yeah. I eat din... My dinner is my breakfast. <laughs> um, I usually eat whatever my wife is cooking dinner for her and the kids. Yeah. That's my breakfast. What the fuck, man? It's not working. There's no power coming through. I wonder if this is another prank. Someone might be messing with the power supply to make us. I have around. to fucking. I think I have to go outside and see if the fucking AC broken, plugged up. Oh, hang on a second. I'm gonna run outside and check something real quick. Where? No, I gotta. I gotta see if my AC has because. My AC's been weird for the past while. Like, I, last time I tried to take it out of the fucking window, I noticed there was a bunch of water in it, but apparently there's supposed to be water in it. And so I was gonna fucking, cause I have to put a, um, Keep your cool. a towel underneath. No the, need, so it's my it turn. So sealed. So the fucking, the, <laughs> the bugs don't just fucking this crawl in underneath you. the window. And, um, the fucking. Ready? I wanted to change that towel out and had a big fucking storm, you know? And, um, just in case it was wet. So I took the fucking AC and I put it on the couch and it just, like, fucking poured water out. Like, a half a gallon, it felt like. And I was like, hell no. So I fucking put it back in the window and ever since then, it, it, like, before, it never came in, like, none of the water leaked inside, okay? 
Like, it would all fucking go out the back of the AC unit, you know what I mean? Ever since then, it hasn't fucking done that. Like, it, it goes out the back, but it's... If, like, I just turned it off, and it's still fucking dripping inside my fucking house. Like, I have a towel underneath it because it's that fucking just weird. dripping in my house. Yeah, I don't know why. I have no fucking idea, and I'm just about to fuck... If it wasn't 90 fucking 4 degrees today, I would have kicked the fuck out of the house, like, last year. Because I was so fucking mad at it. But anyways, I'll be back. Yeah. Go that way. Do you think there's more in here? Mm, looks like. Aha! Found you!
Yeah, I don't know what sonic kind of fucking witchcraft is going on. <laughs> is it tipped enough? I, if I tip it anymore, one of two things is going to happen. It's either going the fuck out, or it's going to break my fucking window that's holding oh, me in. Okay. That's weird. It could be something wrong with your... Yeah, the AC unit, I think so, too. Well, I, I literally so the drain hole. I just fucking took a stick and I fucking I like. <laughs> and uh, you you, did, I noticed you, started, you diddled your AC unit, didn't you? <laughs> fuck yeah! I stuck a stick like fucking four inches up in there and fucking reamed it out. <laughs> Poor thing. And uh, it had a little bit of slime around the edge, so it made, that cleaned it out. And then I fucking noticed. So I noticed that if I was. If the stick, if I was holding the stick in there, uh, instead of it going drip, 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 it was fucking pouring out. So like it was, it almost like it was using the stick as a run. So it would, it would fucking it built on the stick. I don't know, something fucking kind of physics was happening. And when I stuck the stick in the hole and left it there, because I, I just that's what I did, and it, I, I, that I just left it there, just and walked back inside. Is the the fucking? It was just almost like a. Uh, a tree with a tap, like when you fucking a pot out on a pine tree. What the fuck is those? Syrup. Uh. Maple syrup. I don't remember. I don't know. I think it's I think it's maple syrup. I think it's maple. Maple yeah, maple trees. And so it was a, a fucking like you know how you fucking stick a fucking thing in that and then it pours out water. Yeah. That's how this was. Like when I stuck the stick in the fucking hole, it just started like the water was like. So I left the stick in the hole. Hopefully it'll drain. And I noticed that my fucking light that I had on in here is attracting fucking trillions of bugs to the outside window. So that's nice. Might have turned that shit off. See what, look at the cameras and see what they can see. That's so weird. How much did, how much did your cameras cost? Uh, four cameras with a box and an HD, uh, like the drive thing. Yeah. Like 150, 140. Really not bad. That's why I did it. It was 40% off, I think. I'm pretty sure I saw a door on the other side of this place. I think I'll And uh, uh, so I got the ones with room. wire, right? Yeah. And you can also. That's so weird. You can also get ones that have no wire, that have um, the wireless, but they run, they run on your Wi Fi, which I don't really like. 